I'm ready, baby. Let's get it. What's up, y'all? How's everybody doing? I hope everything is straight out there. We finally got something in the mail that I've been waiting for for so long, man. It's an eBay purchase. I think we should just skip the intro and just get this thing popping, man. Let's do it. Any guesses? So we got a Nike SB pickup right here, baby. Damn, this is insane. I'm gonna pull out the shoes and I'm just gonna give you guys a little background of them because these actually have a meaning to me personally. So let's pull these babies out, man. Fresh. These are the Nike SB and Supreme Blazers. These were released a long, long time ago. 2005, 2006 era. That's why we have a black Nike SB box. When I first started collecting, I started off with Nike SBs. And a lot of you guys may already know that. When I was at the beginning of this whole sneakerhead uh, adventure or journey, if you guys want to call it that, I restored shoes for a lot of people. And the shoe that came through a lot were the Nike SB Supreme Blazers. At the time, I wasn't making enough money to even purchase these or even think about purchasing them. I was probably making $20 each time I was repairing something and it wouldn't be that often. I didn't have too many options going on because I was just a kid, man. I was a freshman at high school at the time, so, you know, money wasn't really a thing for me. I didn't have a job and cleaning shoes was my hustle. Uh, when I would get pairs like this, I would just appreciate having a shoe like this in my presence like cleaning it up and kind of having it in my possession for the time being because it gave me that feeling that yo this is kind of mine for however long that I'm doing a restoration on this for and this is just like a preview this gives me the feeling of how it would actually be if I owned a pair. And I would get all these nice shoes coming through. I get Dornbecker 6s, I get Dornbecker 3s. I did a couple of Yeezys here and there. And it was crazy just to see these sneakers in front of me. And it kind of put me in that mindset, like what do I have to do in order to get sneakers like this? Because these are expensive sneakers. If you look at GOAT, there's only one size 10 on there since the last time I checked. And it's going for $1,000 plus brand new. And a lot of the used pairs that you see nowadays have a ton of heel drag, they have a ton of this and that. They go for about $750 Realistically. So when I looked online, I went on eBay and I've been following this Supreme eBay listing for like two years already. And I saw these blazers up my size. These are size 10 and a half. And this one wasn't even a buy it now. It was an auction. I started watching it. I saw the price starting to creep up a little bit. And it wasn't high. I think at the time it was like 280 or something like that. And I actually had class when these were going to end. So what I did was I went to the bathroom a couple minutes before and I was just watching the listing and I was watching that price creep up. You know how those eBay listings get and you're like, damn, what do I have to bid to like get these sneakers, man? Cause I need them. I ended up putting an offer for 450 just to give that price gap. At the time when I bid, I think it was 350 ish. So I put a hundred dollar price gap in. And if you guys didn't know this, eBay does this thing where it only increases the bid if somebody outbids it. So if I put 450 and somebody put 375, my eBay automatically puts 385. And then if somebody else bids in at 400, since I already put 450, it'll put in 425, something like that. I ended up getting these for $415 shipped. Bruh, that's fire for these. These are in really good condition. Very hard to find them, like I said, without the crazy amount of heel drag. This has some heel drag, but it's nothing too crazy. The midsoles are a little bit yellow, but Honestly, you know, your boy got that. Yeah, this is a fire sneaker right here. Obviously, you know, Supreme and all that, but look at the materials that they use. Snake skin on the swoosh, kind of that quilted diamond stitch leather on the side. Really, really nice leather quality. And the inside is padded. It has leather on the inside. Like this is a beautiful shoe. I've seen David roll through so many Supreme Blazers, man. I was like, yo, it's my time to shine. Let me get them. So yeah, these are fire. Let me know if you guys think this was a steal deal or not in the comment section down below. I honestly think that it's a steal, even though it's a high price. It's not a high price for these sneakers. Go and check the internet. Let me know what you guys come up with. Freaking love this pair and I can't wait to throw them on this is gonna look sick with some raw denim man Ooh, we're gonna kill the game with this one I'm hyped I'm excited let me know what you guys think steel deal or not on this eBay purchase I'll catch you guys in the next video it's your boy sneakerhead in the bay I'm out Peace. I said I'm driving Mercedes my windows not tinted they look at me crazy I ride through my city I talk to that bitch like look what you made me we came from the base